Welcome to all of you who are joining us for this innovative dance program. I am Jim Nolan and this 19th century building and I are the hosts for the Rusty Pickup Barn Dance Group program that uh, would have been done in person with all of you in the Oddfellows Hall upstairs. Step with me now from this Main Street location in Toulon, Illinois in Stark County and we'll go through the building and up to the second floor to the Independent Order of Oddfellows for the dance. I'm delighted to be your host for this dance. And I'm a newbie to barn dancing, and so I'm going to be learning as well. Here's how the hoedown will go. Just like a regular rusty pickup event, each dance will be taught by the caller, and you need no prior experience or skills, just the willingness to have some fun. Our demonstration dancers will dance along with you so you simply follow those leaders in a blend of dances you can do with any number of people, or even just by yourself. Our musicians, the Red Wigglers, have put together a set of tunes just for this occasion. And don't forget to show your appreciation for their efforts by placing a donation in the tip jar. Take it away, Wigglers! <laughs> Here's a fun dance called the Ozark Rag. You've got your partner, everybody has a partner. If you don't have a partner at home, pretend you have a partner. Or if there's three of you, two of you are partners, then the other one has a ghost partner, okay? Get in promenade position with your partner. Kind of shake right hands, reach under with the left. And you're going to walk around the circle this is a promenade, that means walk, promenade. When I tell you, which is right now, drop hands and face your partner, back away four steps, one, two, three, four, and clap, 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 stomp, stomp, stomp. Excellent. Do-si-do -do your partner. With your partner, turn by the right, right hand turn, Alaman turn. Wave that other hand in the air. This is, this is a show-off dance. Very good. Get back in your promenade position, and we start the dance over. Let's walk through it once more, and then we'll do it with the music. Promenade. Wait, yeah, that's okay. Keep promenading. Stop where you are. Face your partner. Back away four steps. One, two, three. Three, four, clap, 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 stomp, stomp, stomp. do si -do, your partner. Whoa, your partner got way away from you there. That's a good. Alaman right, right hand turn. Wave that left hand up and high. Hoop -de 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 -de. Promenade position. Okay, we'll do it with the music, the Ozark rag. Promenade. 
face your part. Back away. One, two, three, four. Clap, clap, clap. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Do si do. Down and right. Wave that left hand. Promenade position. Face your partner, back away. One, two, three, four. Clap, clap, clap. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Do, si, do. Alamed right. Wave that hand. Promenade. Face your partner, back away. One, two, three, four. Clap, clap, clap. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Do, si, do. Turn by the right. Show off. pickup people. Um, I miss you all and um, Peter and I are glad to be with you this afternoon. Um, Peter is a great friend of mine and he's a great guitarist and cellist and uh, composer, arranger, lots of other things we could go on and on. But um, yeah, we've been having a lot of fun playing music together over the last few months and we would like to just share some tunes with you today. So we're gonna start out with a set of old time tunes, Whiskey Before Breakfast, Kitchen Girl, and June Apple. And feel free to make up your own dance for this one. <laughs>
been dancing with you in the beautiful ballroom in Toulon, the planned location for this month's regular dance. But for today's event, you don't have to stay inside. We're moving outdoors now to our woodland ballroom where caller Gail Hentz will lead some more fun dances, including something especially for the children. And be sure to stick around for the waltz at the end. I'd like to introduce to you our demonstration dancers. Da, da, da. And we'll start with the left. We have Joy. Hi, Joy. And then Susanna. Hi, Susanna. Then Lucy. And then Laura. These guys are sheltering together so happily for us they will be able to dance together. So um, they are going to now show us the very first dance. I'll walk it through. We'll walk it through a couple times. And then we'll put on the music and we will all dance. So find a partner, you know, if, and you folks at home, if there's more than one of you, we will find partners. Okay, and then this is going to be a long line dance. So say Lucy and Laura, you come up, you come up in front of those. No, wait, okay, that's far enough. That's far enough up because we got to keep you in focus. Yeah, and the other guys get behind. So you, and then you stand facing your partners. So see, Lucy and Laura are facing each other and Joy and Suzanne are facing each other. And remember, if you have fewer than four people, then just picture where those other people will be and act as if they were there and don't forget to smile at them. You know, and picture your favorite people in those empty spots if you want to. Okay, so now, here we go with the dance. You're gonna put your right hands into the middle of that group of four to make a right hand star. Just put those right hands in and start walking. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then you'll put your left hands in for a left hand star and you'll go right back where you started this round. Then you'll face your partner and you're gonna do si do. That means you walk forward, passing right shoulders, move a tiny bit to your right and then back up and look, there you are back where you started again. And now you're going to take both hands <laughs> with your partner, both hands, and you have eight beats to sashay, and you can sashay down the hall. If you're in your living room, you might have to take littler steps. And if you're outside in your backyard, you can make these nice big sachets and then sachet on back. Very nice. Now, here's one more point, too. Um, if you're someone who doesn't sachet well, some of us have hip issues and sacheting we left behind a few years ago, um, then you can just promenade down the hall, you know, um, but you'll move around. You'll go eight beats that way and eight beats this way. And there you are back where you started and the dance starts again. So let's walk it quickly one more time. Right hand star. Ground for eight beats, and left hand star the other way back. Then face your partner in do si do. Then both hands with your partner in sachet, eight beats as far as you like, and eight beats back. Dun, da, da. There, that's the whole dance. Um, so, I think we are ready for music. What do you say? Shall we try this with music? All righty. Right hand star, left hand star, with your partner do si do, sachet, and come on back, right hand star, left, Do si do. Sasha. Right hand star. Left. Do si do. Sasha. Star. 
weekend of snow. Session. And do si do Session Stop Other way back do si do For this next dance, once again, you'll have a partner. But this particular dance is normally done in a circle, and because it has an end of the center and out, what we're going to do is we're going to ask our fine dancers to stand in kind of a line and pretend that they're in a big circle. So they're facing the camera, and they're holding hands, and they're pretending that there are like at least four more of them so that they have enough room to do some of these moves that they'll need to do for this dance. But Okay, they have their partners, very good. Okay, so the very first thing they're gonna do is take four steps toward the center and four steps out. One, two, three, four in, and one, two, three, four back. And if you wanna make a little noise when you do that, you can. You'll do that again, so your chance to make some noise. Woo, three, woo, there, okay. And then, and again, you know, normally you would do this in a closed circle, but um, I suggest keeping it an open circle. You'll circle to the left, just pretend it's a bigger group than it is and just circle to the left for eight beats. And then you'll circle back to the right. You'll end out about where you started. Then face your partner, and you're gonna to bow to your partner. And then you have a very nice long swing, and you can do a right elbow swing, or if you know another kind of, first do a right elbow swing so people can see that. There, there's a right elbow swing on our right, and another kind of swing on our left. And you might see our demonstration dancers doing various types of swings as we go through this a few times. But you can just do an elbow swing if that's easy for you, whatever you're comfortable with. Oh yeah, and I should mention too, um, when you're doing these dances, remember that um, I'm not really watching you. And so, you know, if you kind of forget where you are or you invent a new move in the middle of the dance, it's perfectly fine. I won't tell a soul, you know. Or if you decide while we're dancing that there's a move I haven't included that you really like and you really want to do, go right ahead. You do that. Um, I'll ask our demonstration dancers not to do that at first. But you guys at home, really, you can do whatever you want. Just enjoy the music and have a good time. Um, and now I'm totally lost where we are. Oh, yes, okay. So um, we've turned, yeah, we've bowed to our partner, we've swung, and then you're gonna take your partner with you and promenade. And again, picture that being a bigger circle because you have 16 whole beats to promenade around in a circle, okay? Yeah, there they go, doo -doo -doo. And we're just gonna pretend they've gone for 16 beats and then they're gonna face us. We'll quickly walk it again, into the center and out, one, two, three, four, in. Woo! Woo and do it again. <laughs> <laughs> and circle to the left. Do, 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 Go back to the right. Do, 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 do. Then bow to your partner and swing. And again, it can be any old kind of swing you want. A right elbow swing is fine. You can, yeah, make it a little bit jazzy if you want, whatever. And then with your partner, you're going to promenade around. How, you know, if you're in your living room, you can go the whole you know, the whole outside of your living room. If you're in a backyard, you could really make some moves there. Yeah, okay, so I think that's very good. I think we are ready to dance. 
Are you ready? Into the center. And do it again. Circle left. Go back to the right. Bow to your partner and swing. Nice long swing. Take your partner, promenade. Join hands into the center. Circle up. Other way back. Bow to your partner and swing. Promenade. Join hands into the center. <laughs> Circle left. Back to the right. Out of your partner and swing. Into the center. Circle. Other way back. Into the center. Circle. Other way. Bow to your partner. And swing. Into the center. Circle. Other way back. Out of your partner. And swing. Promenade. Now we're going to have a couple children's dances. If you have any kids in the house, these are great fun dances. If you're older folks and you'd rather take a little break, you can go get yourself a snack or drink a water. Um, but everybody else, you want to stick around for these. And this one, I'm not going to tell you what to do except to start us off. And then you're going to watch our fine demonstration dancers. And whatever they do, that's what you do. Alrighty, let's go. Circle left.
For this next dance, you'll have a partner, and you'll be in groups of four. And um, the first thing you'll do is you'll join hands in your group of four, and you'll circle left one time around, one time around. You'll end up back where you started. And now, um, you will notice the person on my right, who's closest to us, that's your right too, I guess, is Lucy. Hi, Lucy. Now, Lucy has her partner across from her, but diagonally across from her, is her corner, Susanna. They are now pointing at each other. They are first corners. First corners. And now, in four beats, those first corners are going to trade places. Go! One, two, three, four. The people who are left, Joy and Laura, they are second corners, and they will now trade places. One, two, three, four. Then they'll join hands again, and circle left one time around, you'll end out back in this new spot. Then our same first corners, remember who you are, will have four beats to trade back. One, two, three, four. Our second corners will trade back. There. And now, the couple who's closest to the music, that's Lucy and Joy, they are going to face away from the music and take their closest hands. And they're going to walk down the middle, four beats, one, two, three, four. Then they're going to turn around and come back, one, two, three, four. And then they're going to do what's called a cast around, which means they have eight beats to make a big loop. And they'll end out down below our other two people. They have eight whole beats, so if you have a living room, just take your time. Okay, now everybody takes both hands with their partners. And... Before you actually do this, I will explain one thing, which is that if you want the same people in the same place each time, which might be easier, um, you'll do this next move once and a half so that that couple that was at the top will end up back at the top. If you're feeling bold and adventurous and you want to switch off, but that will have to take some thinking. So um, I think for the time being, we'll assume that we're going to keep the same couple at the top. But what we're going to do is a poussette. Now, if you are a first corner, you will push. You'll go one, two, three, four beats. So you'll be going, yeah. And then one, two, three, four beats toward the middle. And then reverse that. So now, yeah, but uh, and let's see. Hmm. You want to make a loop around each other because we want those um, head people to end up back at the head. So I think you reverse what you did. So let's try that again. So first time, first corners push. Now first corners back up. And now first corners back up. And then first corners push. Um, and you'll want to do that once and a half in that amount of time, and you figure out how to make that work um, so that you end up back where you started. Hmm, we better walk that again, huh? Oh. Okay, so, <laughs> of course, remember, you know, if you decide to make a variation of that, it's really all right. I won't complain, I won't tell a soul. Um, so let's do the whole thing again. Join hands, circle left, circle left, one time around. First corners trade, one, two, three, four. Second corners trade, one, two, three, four. Join hands, circle left. One time around from there. First corners trade back, one, two, three, four. Second corners trade back. Our close couple is going to walk down the center, one, two, three, four, and come back and then cast around. And actually, yeah, yeah, okay, that's fine, I see. And then you're gonna do that poussette once and a half. So however you can do it to end out 
back where you started. Do -do -do. Yeah, there we go. Kind of like a do-si-do, -do, really, only doing it as couples. There. Um, that looks good, I think. Let's do it with music, shall we? Remember, you'll start with a circle to the left. Circle left. First corners trade. Second corners. Circle left. First corners trade back. Second corners. Ones down the center. That's that head couple. Come on back. And cast around. Everyone who's set. Once and a half. So you end up back where you started. Join hands. Circle left. First corners trade. Second corners. And circle. First corners trade back. Second corners. Head couple down the center. And come on back. And cast around. Join hands with your partner. Who's set? Once and a half. Join hands. Circle. First corners. Second corners. Circle. First corners. Second corners. Ones down the middle. Come back. Cast around. Who's set? Join hands, circle. First corners, second corners, circle. First corners, trade back, second corners, trade back. Head couple down the center. Come back, cast around. Who's set? Circle. First corners. Second corners. Circle. First corners. Second corners. So we are going to share with you now a couple of tunes that Peter and I arranged. Uh, we've been having a lot of fun doing arrangements for fiddle and cello. And these are two of my favorite tunes, On the Danforth and Fleur de Mondragore. On the Danforth is a old English tune and I could see a very stately, elegant dance being done to that, so you can um, have fun making up your dance, your own dance for that. And then Fleur de Mondragore is a French Canadian, very lively tune. And we're going to dance too. We're going to dance too. Yeah. Well, actually, our fingers are going to do the dancing. <laughs> yeah, and I have to make sure I don't I don't start um, stomping too loudly or. Everyone's or gonna everybody's good, but that's maybe a good be thing because then they'll know where the beat is. Yeah. <laughs> All right. There you go. Shall we do it? Yeah.
Emmy, what time is it? It's polka it's time. Polka time. <laughs>
We hope you've enjoyed this online program of music and dance. Feel free to add your comments here on Rusty's Facebook page. And there's even a place where you can leave a tip for the musicians. Thanks so much for joining us, and I hope it won't be long before we can get together again in person. <laughs>